Hey everybody, welcome to Bingo Games 23. It wouldn't be a school year without a Bingo Games. And two of our seniors, Kayla Rafkin and Maddie Howard said, you know what? We're gonna make sure Bingo Games happens. So they've designed this day for us. I wanna thank them especially and all the teachers that volunteered to get us together one more time as one big school. As always, we're gonna be competing. Let's hear yellow. Let's hear green. Let's hear black. Let's hear blue. Let's hear red. And as we're out there competing, we're also gonna be competing for local charities during this COVID-19 crisis. Everybody plays, everybody wins. Everybody plays, everybody plays. So I'm gonna turn it over to the girls, but you guys are gonna have a great day and welcome to Bingo Games 23. Hello Bengals, I'm Kayla Rafkin. Hello Bengals, my name is Madison Howard. I just wanted to wish you guys good luck on Bengal Games 23. Here are the charities you'll be playing for. The red team will be playing for Greensboro Urban Ministry. The green team will be playing for Backpack Beginnings. The blue team will be playing for the Interactive Resource Center. The yellow team will be playing for the North Carolina Restaurant Workers Relief Fund. And finally, the black team will be playing for Doctors Without Borders. We have a few other Bengals who want to say hello and wish their teams good luck. Hey guys, I'm Kaysen Pierce. I'm the Senior Executive Student Council President at GDS. And next year, I will be going to Duke University as a freshman. And my favorite Bengal Games memory has to be winning last year on the red team. So that was awesome. And everyone, good luck and have a great online virtual bingo games. What's up, everyone? It's Harrison Tuck, class of 2019, and formerly of the black team. Uh, I am now at the University of Georgia studying real estate and marketing. And so now I'm basically part of the red and black teams. Um, I know bingo games isn't, you know, what we're all used to, but it's going to be great. And you're going to make some great memories. I still remember my first bingo games in kindergarten. We got our tie-dye bingo games 10 shirts. They were awesome. I still have mine somewhere. Um, and I know you're all going to have a great time. I wish you the best of luck. And always remember, it's a great day to be a Bengal. What's going on, y'all? It's John Newman here, Greensboro Day School, class of 2018. Um, right now, I'm a student athlete on the basketball team at Clemson University. And things are going well, so I'm enjoying that a lot. Uh, my favorite Bengal games memory has to be uh, we were in the alumni gym. I think Miss Radecki was, uh, was running it. And we were just in there. We were playing wiffle ball with the uh, like rolling chairs. And so it was just so funny to me because all the little kids were trying to hit the ball and then get on, get their balance on the chair and roll all the way to first base and try to get the second. And uh, they were just like falling over and stuff like that. And it was just so funny to me, like, you know, just being an older kid and, and, and watching them have fun with it, you know, falling around but having fun with it. It was just, it was just great for me. And, um, Lastly, go big blue, man. Y'all hold it down. I think we won it a couple years when I was there, but man, go ahead and get a little streak going real quick, man. Go, go blue team. So, here we hey go. everyone, my name is John Ball, uh, GDS class of 2017, and I'm currently a senior at Duke University. Uh, my Bengal games team was Green Team 11, led by the wonderfully enthusiastic Miss Olson, and my favorite Bengal games memory was from my senior year where I was the one who got to lift up the kindergartner who put the last box into the giant Bengal Games box puzzle. Good luck to everybody playing in this year's virtual Bengal Games. And remember, everybody plays, everybody wins. Hey, fellow Bengals, this is Jonathan Campbell, graduate in 2012 from GDS. I just wrapped up playing four years professional soccer and now transitioning to get my master's in business from UVA. Um, I think one of my favorite memories is definitely uh, trying to figure out if Red Team was cheating. Uh, we still to this day couldn't prove it, but I'm sure of it. Um, but also I loved when everyone was getting back together in the gym, all the teams filling in, um, and just the excitement building around it. I'm sorry that you guys w aren't able to do that, um, but I want to say good luck to you guys this year in your virtual bingo games, and especially good luck to my team, Yellow. Let's go, guys. Hey, Bengal Nation. This is Peter Amadon. I went to Greensboro Day School in the 80s as a student. I taught at Greensboro Day School in the 90s. I'm one of the co-founders of Bengal Games. Little known fact about Bengal Games, Mr. Head still does not know how to assign activities to all of the teams. 
So every year he reaches out to me and I sign the scooter relay or the egg drop or whatever the activity is to all the teams. So if you want some super sweet activities going forward, reach out to me and I will hook you up. Bengals, have a great time today with the first ever virtual Bengal games.